During all those months in prison, we talked so much about you. We were sure you were dead. When they freed us, I had decided to go to the Crusades. And it was in Jerusalem that I heard you were alive. But I was surprised by what they said. That you had abandoned the life that you once loved so much. That you were looking for a new purpose, a new meaning. You were right, of course. I tried that too. Only for me it failed. Yet it's too easy to blame the Crusades for this loss, this emptiness, this dissatisfaction I feel. The horror of war, the destruction of our ideals is part of it, I know, but there's something else. I feel stifled by my past, by my upbringing. None of it means anything to me anymore. And you, Francesco, you know better than anyone else that I cannot live without an ideal, without something to believe in. Perhaps I'm wrong. Perhaps one should be more cynical and forget ideals. I don't know. That's why I thought I had to come and talk to you. What's the matter? That would make a worthy cornerstone. Strong and true. Where did you get these? Some quarry near here? Yes. It's not far. I can take you there if you like. Thank you, Bernardo. Let yourselves be built as living stones unto a spiritual temple. 